Hi, my name is Caitlin Keat, and uh, like some of you out there, I have started my path just not too long ago, maybe four years ago. I was raised fundamentally Christian, and kind of that, um, that little fear about not being able to really follow your heart on what you'd like to do in your life. And after a while, my heart actually really started to hurt, and uh, it just got worse and worse. I went to different doctors, and they said, Darling, there's nothing wrong with you. And so finally, I got really brave, and I stepped out, and I went to see an intuitive. And she told me, Caitlin, you are not on your path. And you know when you recognize truth in your body, every cell in my body just lit up. Like, ding, ding, ding. I thought, you know what? I'm going to take off my fear goggles of what I was raised with as somebody else's belief system. I'm just going to set those down for a while, and I'm going to step out into the world, and I'm going to feel my way and trust that I will be able to recognize what is love or what is not love and what's truth for me. So I stepped bravely out. At first it was a toe in the water and then I'm like, okay, out I went, exploring my way with my feelings. And you'll, you'll be amazed how much you can really feel what's your truth or not and really believe that you're able to do that. And by doing that, I think I really started to believe in myself and I opened up and it's amazing how quickly you can go from being kind of shut down and blinders on um, to going out and just all of a sudden answers. And one of my friends who I was trying to get to catch me up on all this says, no, I'm not going to tell you. You have all the answers within. And I thought, oh, she's not telling me because I've teased her all these years because she was more into the spiritual than myself. And um, it was the best thing she could have ever said to me is I did have the answers within. And as soon as I started to believe that, the information started to flow. And as a child, I've had an experience where all through my life I've had trees that have been trying to communicate with me. And I just did the kind of, okay, that's really weird. Uh, <laughs> that didn't just happen. And finally I decided to open up and just start to listen to nature. And I've always found that the truth is in nature for me. And then when I asked, one of, the, one of my favorite questions is, with all, you know, we're aware of all these um, compression folks, I call it, where, that are really trying to keep us in that limited state. Now, limited was an experience we chose to have, and as we're moving out of that now into expansion, some of the folks that like to keep us limited are trying to hold on to that. And I asked Mama Earth, I'm like, so what do we do about that? How do we fight it? And I hear back, we don't fight that. We don't need to fight that at all. As the vibration of our planet increases, naturally those things or intentions that are of a lower uh, vibration will have the opportunity to shift up and come along for this this expanded version of our ride or they they, they just won't be be around so that was really nice to know that all is well and we're in the most exciting time on the planet I have so many things to share from nature with you on, uh, on nature's perspective of what's coming up and some of the exciting things, but one of them I'll leave you with is, I believe human super abilities are just around the corner.